Hi Harry, it's Mike. I'm coming to you from the Bat Cave. I'm not really sure why we call it the Bat Cave because it's not a cave and there aren't any bats. Uh, I'm your eldest son. Um, I'm going to turn 57 years old. You raised me on a very, very strict diet of Mad Magazine and Time Magazine, which means I find everything funny and I can beat most people in a game of Trivial Pursuit. You also at quite a young age introduced me to Casablanca, which means that I see life in black and white and I really do believe that everything is going to be okay. Um, I am divorced. Um, I have a wonderful daughter. Her name is Sasha, and she's somewhere around here. Sasha! Sasha! Hi, I'm Sasha. I'm 15 years old, and I'm definitely the favourite grandchild. I love, absolutely love dancing. Um, my favourite memory with you is when Hannah and I pushed you into a thorn bush at one of the grandchildren's birthday parties. And thank goodness you've been kind of okay since then. Or well, we think you are anyway. Not sure. So, anyway, Harry, love you. Love you. Bye. Goodbye. Hi, Dad. I'm Ian. I'm your middle son. I'm married to Claire. My daughters are Hannah and Rachel and Rhonda. I work in the restaurant industry. I supply point of sale software. Thank you for always being a great dad, making me feel loved and always making me feel like you're proud of me. Hi Harry, it's Claire, your daughter-in-law. Uh, I love photography. Um, I could always be found outdoors exploring new places or in the garden. With a camera or a phone, I pretty much love taking photos of anything and everything. Um, I have memories of, of attending that workshop with you years ago, that photographic workshop at the Sunnyside Park Hotel in Johannesburg and going with you to your camera club. Um, I love scrapbooking, especially family photos. Um, family is very important to me. I'm very grateful for having you in my life and for the wonderful grandparent that you've been to Hannah and Rachel. We love you and see you soon. Bye Dad. Hey Graham. Hey Grandpa. I'm Hannah. I'm 15 years old and my interests are dancing, singing, acting and playing the piano. I just wanted to say thank you so much for the endless jokes and toilet jokes no matter how many times you told them. Love you so much. <laughs> hey Grams, I'm Rachel. I'm 13 years old and I'm in grade 8. Um, I enjoy doing poetry and I enjoy maths and chess. I'm very brainy. And I just want to say thank you for always being there for us, being a great grandparent and always making us laugh when we need to. Love you. Love you. Bye. <laughs> Hi, Grandpa. Zante, I'm in grade four. I love maths as my favorite subject. My best memory of us was my grandpa's birthday. It was a magical day. I loved it so much. Especially since you and Grandpa were together. The balloon incident. We blow up a balloon. I accidentally let it go. It flew away. To this day, we call it the magical balloon. So, thank you for being the best great Grandpa of these. Hi Grandpa, it's Rhonda here, Ian's daughter from Cape Town. Um, I just want to thank you for being an awesome role model, great father, father, grandfather and great grandfather. I want to tell you we love you a lot. Bye bye. Bye bye. Hi Popsicle, this is me, your daughter Ada, living in Tucson, Arizona. I have four children, Yoni the oldest, who is married to Deborah Lea. And they have two children, Levi and baby Menachem Mendel, who was just born two weeks ago. Then there's Dundan, and he is living and working in California. Then there's little Shainala, and she is uh, in high school and studying in Los Angeles, but thank God, still living in Tucson. And then there's little Rochela, who's 10, and she's going into fifth grade and we live in Tucson as I said and you've been to visit us quite a few times we love your visits we love and treasure all the photographs that you take when you're here we have them in the house as well as some of your um, x-ray films that you took of the flowers 
and I'm still doing the bookkeeping. You met my boss when you were here. She also does photography. Her name is Dot. I do bookkeeping and we do, um, it's not exactly an employment agency, but we help people with disabilities to get back into the workforce. And that's what we do here. I'm hoping to come to South Africa in the next couple months to see you, to see you all. And because we miss you and maybe if you can come visit us, that would be really awesome. And lots and lots of love, love you madly. Thank you for being a loving, caring dad. And we all treasure your visits and the time that we've spent with you so much. And love you madly, Dad. God bless. Mwah. Hi, Grandpa Harry. This is your son-in-law, Rabbi Billy. <laughs> uh, I just want to say how much uh, you mean to all of us. We have such amazing memories about you coming to Arizona, coming to Tucson to visit us. Um, I remember our hot air balloon flying over Sedona. I want to thank you for everything, all the good things you've given to all of us um, and, and, your, and our children, your grandchildren, you've given us such good memories um, of all the time you spent with them. But most of all, I want to thank you for allowing me to marry your beautiful daughter Ada and including me in your family. <laughs> thank you so much Grandpa Harry, we love you so much. Hi Grandpa Harry, it's your grandson Yoni. Your granddaughter-in-law Dvorlea and Little Levy. There's many things you taught us over the years, some of them being... You can lead a horse to water, but a pencil must be led. And would you like a progan? I don't know. I never proged. Thank you so much for teaching us how to love, how to smile, and showing us how to care. And most importantly, the one thing you taught us very well was... Piso de Sontes something... Basically, if you go to the bathroom without farting, it's like eggs without salt. Thanks, Grandpa Harry. We love you. Mwah. 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 Hey, Grandpa Harry. It's Donnie, uh, Ada's son. I'm currently living in Los Angeles. Uh, I'm going to be studying social work and education. Uh, it's been a very long time since I've seen you. I think the last time was uh, Yoni's wedding. I had a lot of fun there. Um, you know, as you always said, time flies like an arrow, fruit flies like a banana. And, uh, you know, as well as many of the other uh, sayings that you had, uh, you know, such as fuzzy wuzzy was a bear, fuzzy wuzzy had no hair, fuzzy wuzzy wasn't fuzzy wuzzy. Um, I definitely, you know, attribute a good chunk of my sense of humor uh, coming from you. Um, and uh, I just want to know that I miss you and I think about you a lot. Hi Grandpa Harry, it's Shana. I just want to say that I really, really miss you. I haven't seen you in so long. The last time I saw you was when I was in South Africa for our joint birthday parties, but that was super, super fun. I hope I can see you soon right now while I live in Tucson, but I go to school in Los Angeles. I'm entering my last year of high school, which is so, so scary, and I'm not really sure what I want to do afterwards. Probably go to school in Israel for a year, and then hopefully go to college. I don't know. I love you so, 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 so much. Mari, it's Rachi, your favorite grandchild. I'm 10 years old, I'm going into fifth grade, and I like singing, acting, and dancing. I remember the time we went to Sabino Canyon together, and we had a bunch of fun, and you took lots of pictures. I love it when you take pictures, and I hope I get to see you soon.